Hey, what is up, everyone? This is Dark Sage 101, and welcome back to Let's Play Fire Emblem: The Order of the Crimson Arm. Oh, uh, well, last episode we got like a little over halfway through this chapter. Uh, it's actually a pretty long chapter. We're, um, we're gonna finish this off and uh, defeat Warren in this episode. Uh, now, sorry for like the late upload today. Uh, I've been fighting my emulator today, so it's been, you know, it's been lagging like crazy. It actually froze on me at one point or crashed uh, I've resetted my laptop like twice so far and it's just my gosh it's been a lag fest finally got it to work it is still lagging just a little bit especially in the video I actually saw it so I apologize for the lag but I really can't do much about it so uh, in this episode today we're gonna be uh, finishing this off so without further ado let's do this And so far, this is really nothing. Okay, well, we obviously need to put a sword user there, so yeah, you. Yeah, perfect. Wait, you have a hand axe? Yep. <clears throat> and then you reach Dark and Rorik. Rorik can take it. And uh, then the rest of that's fine. You know what? I'm actually going to stay. Hi. Yeah, see, it is lagging just a little bit here. Yeah, I had like the biggest lag spike off screen. It literally lasted like five minutes. So I don't really have much time to record. I'm trying my best to actually finish off this chapter, but like right now it is 12:18. I gotta leave at uh, before one, so I gotta really hurry up here. Okay. We'll just do this. Nice, dude. That's great. Yeah, see, look at the lag. HP speed and luck. Eh. She needs strength. Alright. Dang it. Do you have a ranged weapon? You do. You have a javelin. Then that is not smart, so I'm going to go back. I'm just gonna put Rorik right there and have Elaine heal her or heal him. All right, oh, and then a oh, wow, that's quite a bit. magic and resistance. It's kind of all she needs right there. And then we'll go ahead and that's not a finishing blow. Oh, well, that works. Thank. Alright, so here is some issues. Alright, so you're taking three shots. Iron Lance, Steel Lance. He can handle both of those. This guy, however. I think we're probably going to stay again. Yeah, we don't really... We really can't do much right now, so... Oops. Oops. Alright, come on. Stop lagging. Thank you. Alright, that works. Okay, so it's only six damage, but I'm doing like 20 back. And doubling. Missed. All 
Okay, so that's what Odin looks like. He actually looks pretty cool. He's a green uh, fighter. Going for Odin. All right. Nice. Yeah, I gotta finish this up as fast as possible. Might not be able to even read all the dialogue. We'll see. I'll probably end off the episode once we kill the boss. And then I'll read all the dialogue tomorrow. Because I have a really big uh, time constraint in here. Right. Yeah. Okay, good. He's still at 27, so he's fine. Does this guy reach? Yeah, of course he does. It's probably gonna go for him, to be honest. Okay. Yeah, sword. Oh, wow. Um, yeah, we'll just have him do this. Alright, earn sorcerer level up. Strength and skill. Uh, okay, so you're down to three. I think I'm gonna have you go for the fighter. Yep. Nice. There we go. Skill, luck, and resistance. Man, her stats are looking great. Look at this. <laughs> I I don't know if I want to use Bolslav. He's good though. I will have to know. Bolslav is really good, but dang. This uh this archer is insane. Yeah, let's go with that. What was Chara? Uh, she's at promotion level, but I'm not going to promote her because she's like, <laughs> she's not great. Martel, though, is pretty good. Uh, I believe Brigands of uh, promote into Berserkers, which is really nice. Definitely something I want. Pretty sure they promote into Berserkers in this game. Which, if that's the case, I definitely want that. Yeah, this is safe right here. Uh, yeah, we'll just heal Ernst. Alright, and then rescue. Go for this guy. There we go. Oh, that's exactly what you like to see. Very nice, almost perfect. All right, that was good. Support, I'm guessing with Ernst. Okay, I still got a couple more enemies left. We, we might be able to actually finish. We'll see. I definitely want to get that village over there. I'll just have, uh, what's his name go over there? Uh, Sven. Or Rorik. You know what? Rorik. Rorik can do this. Uh, we'll just have Mila go there. Alright, come on. Stop lagging. Stop it. All right, come on, stop lagging. Stop it. Thank you. Lord of the One, you're not hurt. Oh, that's what the characters replace. Oh, that's kind of cool. So this is Marcus and this is Elliewood. I mean, it kind of makes sense, but still. Okay, actually Odin's really low. He's not gonna take 17 though, let me tell ya.
Okay, I'm actually going to rescue Celia. There we go. And the rest of that's fine. Let's have Martell like go right here. Let's have Curtis go there and then just have Dark uh probably in the forest right here. Yeah. Alright, there we go. Yeah, that, they don't really have much left. They didn't really have that big of a force. They only had like 20, it was like 25. So they really, they really did not have a lot of guys. Okay, so now we gotta get these guys out. Can Martel do anything? Uh, yeah, you can finish this guy off. Yeah, sure, why not? Wink. Nice. That's good. Alright, so we got Steel Sword. You're fine, and you're fine. Okay. Martel's good. Yep, that's good, and then put Odin like over here. Put Ernst over here. What, what level's Ernst? 12. He's actually caught up, which is good. He wasn't that far behind, but he was falling behind. Or he was going to. If I didn't give him uh, at least like a couple levels. Because was what was he at? Like 11? Well, I gave him one level and he caught up. Well, because everyone's around, like, between 12 and 15 right now. Well, 12 and 14, because my highest level is 14, not being a uh, bull slav. It's the reason why I didn't bring him, because he's so high level. Yeah, he's the definition of overleveled right now. Yeah, I need everyone else to get experience. I'm still wondering who to actually bring in terms of uh, archers. I'm leaning towards Celia, but we'll see what happens. I might even bring both, to be honest. Because they're both just insane. One has super high attack, and the other one has super high speed. So, I mean, look, look at this. Like, how can I not say no to these stats? Alright, uh, yeah, let's go with Thunder. Wow, she has 11 crit with that. Jeez. That's pretty cool. Okay, uh, we can finish this guy off. Wink. Martell the Wyvern Slayer over there. And then we'll do Halberd on this guy. Nice. Okay, Mila's fine. Now I got her back to the normal force. All right, now we just gotta uh, beat War. I'm uh, not War um, Warren. I think he's the last one. Uh, no. Well, technically, it's just that knight in him. He's got 40 health. Let's just, uh, yeah, this guy's gonna be annoying. I gotta get some hard-hitting weapons for him. What does he have equipped? The worst weapon to actually fight, lovely, or Silver Axe, great, that's a hard-hitting weapon. Did they change the stats on that weapon? Nope, seems about the same. 15 might, yeah, it seems reasonable. That seems the same as FE7. That's pretty cool. No, the only thing that I know that they changed is the, uh, the, what's it called, the, uh, the magic. Okay, can I get in there? How do I do this? Because this technically isn't a gate. Oh, I probably have to go around. Oh my gosh, this is going to be tedious. Maybe I do have to kill this knight. Let's just do this.
Uh, staff heal Martel for experience. Looking good. Yeah, I still got another med. You're fine. I'm actually going to do this. Rescue. Do this. And then drop more off right there. Might have to actually ferry people around. Let's see. This is all planes. I can stand right there with no res. What's his res? Uh, seven. Okay. So we can do this safely. He has no range. Well, he does, but he doesn't have the range weapon equipped. The Owl Spice actually might work on that. Uh, but I'm worried he's gonna double. What's his speed? What, eight? Yeah. Gosh darn it, lag. Okay. Yeah, Rorik is fine. Yeah, one damage, terrifying. Alright. Nice. Putting in the work. Alright. Let's go get this village. Oh! That's why. It was the village. Oh my goodness gracious, seriously? Okay, well. That works. So we got a heavy spear. Does that work on him? Yep. Sure does. Dude, this guy is going to be impossible. Look at this. Oh. Oh gosh. Okay. That's uh that's worrying. Oh my gosh. Yeah, this guy's a meat grinder. Look at this guy. Oh man. Okay, let's do this. Your hardiness deserves praise. However, you shall not pass. Cool. Uh... Oh, they changed the animation of Oh my gosh, that looks awesome. <laughs> That is really cool. Strength, skill, luck, defense, and resistance. Perfect. There you go. Finally got strength and level up. Good. All right. Let's keep putting in the work. Um, yeah, let's do that. 15 damage is really good. Messed. This might be a luck-based fight. This might actually take a bit. All right. Rescue. Also rescue. Um, ooh, how am I going to do this? Let's see, you're down to 21. You got a silver axe equipped. But you can go straight into Sword Reaver and finish me off. So I need to... I need to actually rescue. Boom. Okay, this is going to take me a little... Now... Okay. Take. Drop. Boom. Take. Nope. Take. Come on. Take. Drop. No. Okay. Ah, poop. Um. I messed this up. Okay. How much? Um. Okay. Oh, poop. Um. Oh wow, I can do high damage. Okay, that's pretty cool. But I'm worried, yeah, I might have messed this up. Um, Cause I put my heal in a precarious spot. Oh boy, I think I lost poop. Uh, oh jeez. Um, yeah, this has suddenly gotten grim. Ah, poop. Okay, let me do a quick save state there. I don't think that's going to save me, though. I might have to actually restart this. Dang it, we were doing so good. Oh my gosh, this mess. Oh, okay. <laughs> Oh my gosh, okay. Chiara can actually get this, and I kind of want to give it to her. 
Oh my gosh. Okay, yeah, I almost failed right there. That would have been really bad. He probably had a really low chance to hit, but still. Oh my gosh, dude. Okay. Well, we're good, though. We're good. We're good. Oh my gosh. Yeah, we almost lost right there. That would have been really bad. Okay, so he's down to seven. Okay, that's good. One damage. Better than nothing. There we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Perfect. Do it. Nice. I I can't die here. Darn you. Oh my gosh. Okay. I nearly messed that up. Oh man. Whew. Support with who? Oh, Ernst? Lowen. Oh, that. Oh, really? Curtis is Lowen? Really? Huh. <laughs> the more you know. Alright, well, that was, uh, that was a mess. Now that, now was it? Alright, cool. We've incapitated the gatekeeper. Incapacitated, incapacitated or whatever. Seems he, he's more resilient than he lets on. It's only natural. The blood of Valborg the mountain flows through his veins after all. Do you hear that? Seems the fight isn't, the fight isn't finished just yet. Gah! Rebel scum. Wayland, what are you doing? Nothing? I got this. For Elo's sake, this is no this is a death match, not a spar. Yeah. Thank you. Wayland, you aren't cut out for this. You should go home. I'm fine, that was just a bit of a hitch. And that bit of a hitch could have gotten you killed. Why the heck did you not let anyone else know that there were still enemies? I thought I could handle it. Now with that tit for tat style you seem to be so inclined towards. Oh, I'm fine. I just need more practice is all. Ugh, you. He's gonna get himself killed like this. He's definitely a stubborn one. Did you not say he was without ambition though? Ellipsis. Two days later. Ah, uh, Sir Bur... Borgriff, you seem you look chipper as usual. And you, young Andrew, still carry out the undif ding yeah, undignified manner of speech. Of course, where's Warren? I've got orders to take him to his father orders to take him to his father and her majesty. Locked away in a dungeon for now, here is the key to his cell. Thanks much. By the way, here are here are here are your little group's orders. Good luck. Indeed. Seems we've orders from Velbor to continue our march, march, our march towards the capital while they are still besieging the fortress. According to this map, it would, it would appear our shortest and clearest course has us go through these dark woods. A treacherous and dangerous wood, a world went road to be sure strategically difficult to move against alas all other courses would require us to force our way through a barrage of reinforcements a task guard task guard troop could can't handle and even this the dark woods seem seems like a ideal hiding spot for the enemy indeed we must plan plan our route carefully time is of the essence so our advance needs to be divisive or decisive I butched all those lines, goodness gracious. Hi, Cortez. My leash. Least peg has fallen. What? Zounds, what can I expect from these men if they cannot even hold a dartable fortress? Whoa, you look cool. Fret not. Wait, fret not yourself, Cortez. I'm, I have a way to squash this, this petty uprising. Make, 
McDowell. McDowell. It is far too risky for someone of your station. You protected myself and n other nobles from the Inquisition's dark magic hunts. This actually, this guy does not look like an enemy. He kind of looks like recruitable. He probably is, but we'll see. There's no other, there's no better way for us to show, show you our thanks. Perhaps so. You are ready to die at your hand to prevent the Inquisition from suspecting you further. I, I can think of no better end. Very well. Then as your king, I order you to crush these rebels. Consider it done, my liege. Okay. Maybe not. I don't know. Okay. There we go. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and end off the episode here. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And go get ready for work. I have 18 minutes to get ready, so oops. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you on the next one, which will be tomorrow. The next episode, we're going to be doing the next chapter, which I have no clue what to expect, other than McDill could be either a recruitable or could be a, another boss. But we'll see what happens. Could be even a future boss. But I'll see you on the next one. Goodbye. Good chapter, by the way.